Hi guys, in this video, we are going to discuss about the different type of transfer we can do from Avaya. Uh, one of them is blind, another one is the bleach. So let's go to the code side. So it will be easy to understand, right? So uh, if you see under the templates, right, in the palette side, you will see that we have a blind bridge and concentration. Uh, I've never used concentration in my life so far. But what I know is bridge and concentration is more or less same. Okay. Uh, so first we will see what is the blind transfer as the name indicate, right? Uh, uh, what is blind? Blind means uh, the person who cannot see, right? So similarly from IVR perspective, if you see uh, what blind transfer means, when it is transferring the call to any VDN, any phone number or anything, right? It does not know what is status it has connected it properly or not whatever the outcome is it just transfer the call and hang up the session so that is what it means uh, what are the things that we have over here is uh, you can obviously give a name okay you can play a prompt like uh, please wait while we transfer or whatever you required uh, you can add uh, there was something called properties uh, yeah okay so in this uh, you can transfer uh, like give details like transfer number variable if it is like a, in a variable in the IVA journey where you found the number mostly we transfer through VDN number so from VDN it goes to the CM okay uh, then AI data is there now what is AAI AI is application to application information transfer okay so let's say from this IVA the call is going to another IVA then you want to pass the information like we do in the usable model so that is where the ai data comes into the picture okay what type of transfer module you are using are you using SAP, aml i have no idea what those mean but uh, yeah uh, then shared ui you have to mention the, the shared ui because this is what we mentioned in aep how the user to user information will be transferred this is basically used uh, to share the your uh, what is that uh, ui details uh, which is present in the session variable you can also set uh, external properties like the sip headers that you want to add uh, over here okay so similarly this was the blind transfer i will delete this and i will copy the bridge transfer so only difference between the blind and the bridge is the bridge have the information once the call uh, goes to the let's say a particular VDN it knows uh, the state like the call is connected or not connected uh, if there is an error it will know so that you can uh, if there is an error you can handle that and say that okay we are not able to connect something like that also you can do uh, reporting activity once the call goes to the agent agents complete that again from cm call comes to the ivr uh, over here you can log some reporting time like how much time has particular call taken before and after transfer and all those things so so yeah uh, those details you can add again uh, there are a few additional parameters over here like how many seconds it should wait to uh, before uh, the call get connected okay so let's say it can wait for the 30 second uh, maximum 30 second or if you want to increase let's say 60 second so you can increase to 60 second like for one minute wait for a uh, particular uh, phone number to be available or connect to the particular vdn or queue so the time you can mention then you can rest of the details are same and uh, so you get one more details over here. I forgot what was that. You get errors. Uh, I think uh, we have to use catch to get the events. Yeah, I think yes, yes, yes. yes. I completely forgot about this. Yeah. So you have to first uh, manually create uh, the events. Okay. Uh, and then you can catch it uh, while you perform this thing 
so you get uh, error and some other specific uh, events specific to that uh, again what was the AI uh, AI was application to application information that you can pass while transferring from one application to another one and you can specify variable name if it is stored in the variable if it is like hard coded value that you want to pass that you can pass from here uh, so yeah this is the information about the blind and the bridge transfer uh, concentration transfer is similar where to bridge uh, let me show you the concentration one so if I go back over here you will see that there is a third type is concentration transfer uh, particularly is similar to the bridge but uh, it has some minor changes like uh, uh, it can connect to supervisor or something was there uh, I'm not sure but I have never used it so honestly speaking mostly I have used blind and uh, bridge transfer for all of my projects that I have did so far in my career yeah hopefully you like the video if any query just put into the comment section and have a nice day